Melissa, along those lines, I want to take a moment to introduce you now to a, a young lady, one of the great success stories at that old hospital, who will serve as an ambassador and a friend and an inspiration to the patients at this new one. If it weren't for the doctors and everyone at Children's, she wouldn't be at Sweet Home. She wouldn't be go doing basketball. She wouldn't be doing dancing. She wouldn't be at Special Olympics. Unified. She wouldn't be the child she is today. When I, I look at her and I think um, about that dedication ceremony and I think she's actually an ambassador for the hospital um, and I go back to those early days and it, it's a proud moment for me. Those early days, 18 years ago, when Jody Katowski and her husband Frank were expecting a healthy baby at another Buffalo hospital. But because of a double wrapped umbilical cord, their newly born daughter Francesca suffered a brain bleed and many other complications. They told us that there was no way she was going to do anything. She would never walk, she would never talk. Um, they told us, be prepared, you're gonna build a wheelchair ramp to your house and we just would not accept it. And with that will, there turned out to be a way at Women and Children's Hospital. 25 surgeries and almost two decades later, Francesca Katowski yeah has beaten the odds. But that's all right, we'll get through it again. The thing is that I'm tough. <laughs> I've always been tough and strong. Yeah. Okay, so we got uh Understatements to say the this. least. Yeah. Walking, talking, and a whole yeah, lot more. Serving as an ambassador and making her way through the old hospital for one of the last yeah, time. And as she looks again. forward to the new building, she says she still thinks about giving back as she did on her 16th birthday. I didn't want any gifts, I just wanted to donate money. Tell me why that's so important to you. Because I feel bad for the families who don't have any money. We have everything we need, right? Yeah. I have my family, that's all that cares. Yeah. That's all I care about. And living a life that some doctors never thought possible. She goes to Sweet Home High School and stars in the Special Olympics. I do ba basketball, baseball, track and field. Bowling. Bowling and a whole lot of medals to show for it. What message would you send to other people? Stay strong, be brave, be who you are. I think if it wouldn't have been for this place, we probably wouldn't be here today. I know we wouldn't be. What an incredible young lady. So inspiring, yeah, oh my goodness. Absolutely, what a personality, what a, a, a force of positive thought, and uh, she's gonna continue to um, mentor patients mm. and work and volunteer with the Stones Buddies program here at the new hospital wonderful. into the future. Just one of the wonderful many patients and um, and she, she really will make a difference here at this hospital as well so many staff members and volunteers here as well.